Hello and welcome to the video by Trump Excel. I am Sumit Bansal and in this video I will show you a picture lookup technique in Excel using named ranges. So here is my data set. I've recently started following football in especially English Premier League so I thought why not take a, an example where I have clubs and club logos. So you can see in column B I have club names. So there are 20 teams that play in one season in English Premier League and I have their corresponding logos in the cell adjacent to it. So at the time of recording this video, uh, Arsenal was at the top of the list uh, followed by Liverpool and Southampton. So let me show you how to create this uh, from scratch. So I have uh, this same list of club name and club logo and I'll show you how to create it from scratch. So to do that, uh, this, first we need to create uh, a data validation list. So I'll select cell E3, go to data, go to data validation, select list here and in source I select all the names of all the clubs and I click OK. So now you can see that I have a drop down list with the names of all the clubs. Now I'll show you how to create uh, the picture that updates itself automatically. So to do that go and select the cell. So I've selected C3. Uh, select the cell that has a logo in it and right click and copy. Make sure that you are copying the entire cell and you're not clicking on the logo but you have selected the entire cell. Once you have copied it go to home and here you have this option of linked picture. Click on this so you can see that it has created an image of this cell. So how this works is that this is a reflection of this cell which is C3. If I delete this logo this picture would automatically update itself. So have a look when I delete the logo the picture automatically updates. If I type something here if I type my name then it automatically gets reflected here in the picture. Let me control Z control Z now, uh, the technique is that whenever you create such cell link or such linked picture, it is linked to a cell. So in this case, this is linked to C3. If I change this to C4, then see what happens. The picture automatically gets updated with the content of C4. In this case, I have uh, logos well placed within the cell, so it gets displayed here nicely. When I change this to C5, then this gets updated. If I make it to C7 then uh, Manchester United logo comes up. So the idea is to have a formula or something here which will automatically get updated when I uh, select a name here. So for example when I select Arsenal then ditch the cell reference for this should automatically get updated to reflect C3. Now in case of these pictures uh, there could only be a cell reference. I cannot use a formula. If I use a formula this would not work. But I can use a named range which returns a cell reference. So I can uh, create a formula, put make a named range out of it in such a way that it returns a cell reference whenever I change this. And when I change this the named range get updated and this picture would change. Let me show you how to do this. Let me first create that formula. I would use index formula here. So in index I select this entire array. Click F4. In row number I select I would use match formula. So I would do match lookup value is here uh, the club name press F4 to lock this. Lookup array would be these all these names. Oops. So I select these. Again I lock this and 0 because I need an exact match. And column number in this case would be So now you can see that this is returning a 0 because uh, 
there is nothing in those cells but if, but if I go and write something here if I write Sumit then this refers to Sumit and this returns Sumit so this means that the formula is working let me delete that I would now use this formula within a named range so I let me copy this formula and I would go to formula define name and here I would create a named range let me call it club logo lookup and I would use the formula and I'll click OK so now I have a named range you can refer to that named range by going uh, to this option which is named manager name manager and you can see that this is the formula that you're using now instead of a cell reference I would change this reference with the named range which is club logo and as soon as I start typing it will prompt me the name of that club and I select this and press enter and that is it now when you select the name of a club this automatically gets updated so you select Chelsea and the logo for Chelsea comes up an interesting thing to note here is that in normal cases index would have returned uh, the value in that cell but since I'm using index formula within a named range it returns a cell reference instead of that value and that is the entire trick of this picture lookup technique so that's it in this video I hope you found this useful for more such tips and tricks on Excel visit my website www.trumpexcel.com or subscribe to this channel on YouTube Thank you and have a nice day.